I think we should make this voting system possible because why wouldn't we be allow people to vote by iPad and iPhone and Android phone and internet as long as they have um, their ID with another form of identification and and then we could also just have places where people can go get help with voting and that way we don't even really have to have polling stations you just have the library where all these staff knows how to help you vote and you just have to be like hey I'm having trouble voting and they go okay here you go um, for people that aren't computer savvy but um, you could even have Best Buy when they have com a computer section we you can vote at Best Buy and then we can even have Walmart where you have an electronic section you can vote at Walmart um, as long as one of the employees knows but um, like, knows how to do it but more than anything is it, all you have to do is have a camera um, in, in your forms of ID and then you have to have someone that t knows how to do it but you might be able to do it because it would be that easy um, and so then we wouldn't have to wait in line and then we wouldn't have to worry about the state having really weak, um, election policies because I mean, but granted we could write multiple versions of the software where you can have multiple voting system, voting, voting forms where you have to put like top three for certain, um, things. But, um, anyways, I, I think I'm kind of banished, banished from running for president. Um, because once you realize that you can only run in 43 states as a write-in and you uh, aren't going to be able to even, and, 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 and then like you realize that you're not like, e like I thought for a second there, I really thought I won some votes in Iowa, but I've looked at the vote count and I had zero votes. So that's part, that's kind of life. And the thing is, I think the, that a lot of people's problem with me is that I'm racist because I think that white people invented everything pretty much. But you have to understand, some of, the, some of the things I said that were terrible, um, like I insulted Kamala Harris pretty bad during imaginary World War III. Um, and, okay, Indian people, India is not very nice. It's, it's a pretty, it's not that nice of a country. But um, they tend to have like the smartest people. Like, like I, uh, all, all the Indians are smarter than me. But that's also because they have the very high end of intelligence that is successful and there are a lot of them but um they still are not as successful as you would think they would be given their intelligence and that's why i said they're the smartest dumb people um and also just because india is not that nice um but um i don't know I, I, and, and it's also re referencing creativity but um obviously um it seems like there are a lot of indians that are doing creative things nowadays so um I feel bad about what I said about Kamala Harris. Very bad. And nowadays I'm sitting there going, is she one of us? Like, but uh, I don't think so because, well, maybe. I don't know. It's kind of weird. I don't know. All I'm saying is that we should have an easy way of voting. And it should be fair. And and the party shouldn't control who is nominated. Because, like, granted, yeah, I've really said some things about some, some, some people in the Democratic Party. Um, because... Let's face it, like, does Nancy Pelosi own a ton of Facebook stock and Amazon stock? And, like, it's, it's, it's so hard to, for me to wrap my head around not being on Facebook. Because it's like, the, like, it's like, how, how am I supposed to not, how, how am I supposed to go see what certain people are doing? I guess I'd have to go to TikTok, right? But I can't imagine me being able to actually hurt Facebook. But it's kind of similar to me not me thinking that I can't hurt cryptocurrency now. But I before I thought I could absolutely destroy cryptocurrency, and now that nothing happened with the cryptocurrency market, I'm like, maybe all the altcoins are fine. Maybe I don't have an audience at all. Maybe no one cares about what I have to say. Like, but like I think that maybe some people think I'm racist, and that's why they don't care about what I have to say. And then some people are like, who cares about like the way he is? Like, like what what matters is that he can come up with ideas. I don't know.